Each week, we pick one specific Metro Atlanta neighborhood to call out critical changes to help you understand as a homeowner in the neighborhood, are you at an advantage or are you at a disadvantage? This week, we are featuring Brightwater, which is in Snellville. If you are on I-85 going north, you exit on Pleasant Hill, you turn right on Pleasant Hill, you turn right on the Ronald Reagan Parkway, you exit on to Webb Gin House Road and go left. The subdivision is on the left. It is um, basically to the west of 124 and to the north of Ronald Reagan Parkway. And let's get into some details about this neighborhood for the last few years. Now, Tammy, this neighborhood is 362 homes plus or minus. There were 19 homes sold in 2020. The average sales price was $476,000. Those range from a low of 417 to a high of 529,000. The sales price to list price ratio was 97.63%, which means home sellers had to discount their property about two and a half percent. In 2021, prices accelerated almost $120,000 and 35 homes sold in that current year. That's a big market for that year. That's over 10%. Uh, average sales price, $593,000. They range from a low of four forty five dollars to a high of seven thirty. dollars Homes sold for 0.1% more than their list price. So sellers got a little bit more money than they were asking. Now let's move forward to 2022. Only 19 homes sold, same as in 2021. The average sales price jumped another a $75,000 to $665,000. They range from a low of five seventy-eight to a high of eight ten. There are currently two homes listed in the neighborhood. The average list price is six hundred and eighty-two thousand four fifty. Makes sense. Those list prices are all, should be in today's market just a little higher than the sales over the last year which means there's a 1.2 months worth of supply, which means if no new inventory comes on the market, and Tammy, I know I'm speaking to the choir here because you already know this, but if no inventory comes on the market, it'll take 1.2 months to sell the two homes in the neighborhood. Again, 362 homes in the neighborhood, plus or minus. Those homes in 2012 were worth, on average, $300,000. Today, they're worth six sixty five. dollars which means homeowner equity in that one neighborhood, those 362 plus or minus people, have increased their equity in their homes $132 million. Wow. Every time I mention those numbers, you get you have a biggest smile on your face. It's amazing. Isn't it? It is. Isn't I just it? can't think of the, the greatest sense of security in knowing that if I buy a home today, 10 years, what would I be looking at? Yeah.